It's fucking redder than your beard, and look at me. But it's still raw. Yes, sir. No, no. And the chicken is as dry as a fucking camel's arsehole in a fucking desert storm. Look how stringy that is. Chef Ramsay is hoping the fried chicken station manned by Keisha and Jessica can keep up with the orders. Hey, Keisha, is the chicken ready? Yeah, we're gonna need two more minutes. I know I can cook chicken. I cook chicken a hundred times. I eat plenty of chicken. This is wrong. I was browning real fast on the outside, and it wasn't getting done on the inside. Still wrong. Any news? Yeah, we're gonna need two more minutes. Another two minutes. Chicken? It was chicken. Chicken. Give me no, 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 no! Don't even open it. I'm not. I'm not. Wait. She already know her mama gonna curse her out when she get home. Baby, you can't come here if you can't fry no chicken. Hell to the no. Someone explain to Keisha, every time she opens the oven door, what happens? We lose 10 degrees every second. Right. Fucking chicken. Look at Jessica. She's on the station. She's like this. Hey, look. Oh, watch. No, I'm not. Jump in there. The chef. This station is going down. I'm walking over with three piece. And Jessica's watching to see what happens. All right, what do we have after this now? Roll that. It's pink and it's fucking raw. Both of you, come here. Yes, yes. What in the hell is going on? What is happening? Are you trying to kill somebody? No, chef, I'm not. Chef, the breasts are this. It's only the breasts, like the. Get them in early. Yes, yes chef. chef. I'm fucking embarrassed. I feel like this blood on the inside, but I need somebody who's gonna have my back. Come on, Jish. I'm asking for your help. I mean, at least check it for me or something. Chef, chicken. Jason, come here. Holy shit. All of you, come here. All right, I see my error. No, yeah, I see the error, but more importantly, it's fucking ridiculous. Chicken. I don't know how the hell I did that. I was just trying to go on touch, and it's a bitch when it's fried. Raw chicken, stop the table again. Yes, chef. It's an hour into dinner service, and after a solid start, both kitchens have been completely stalled by uncooked chicken, and the sorority sisters are starting to get a little antsy. Morning, where's our food? <laughs> Meanwhile, back in the red kitchen. Check on my chicken, Jess. Check on your chicken. Keisha is looking for some support from her station partner, Jessica. Just get the one that's ready to go now for she'll come back over here breathing on my ass. That one's good. We got one word chicken ready. It's Southern cuisine. I take this kind of personal. Chicken. I'm definitely not going to go out on something that I'm used to, something that's basic and second nature to me. Let's roll this. All of you, come here. It's still raw. Yes, yeah. What is going on? It looks cooked. I said, I. It looked cooked. It looked cooked. My partner tested it, that's why I saw it. If you come up with one excuse, you and you can fuck off. I thought she checked it before we went up there, but that's fine. I don't have no help on chicken over here. I'm over here like by myself on the fucking chicken. Basically, I'm getting thrown underneath the bus for her fucking faults. I don't know what to do, and this is her fucking specialty, which she lost on the challenge. Do you want to do the yes, catfish? No, I mean no, because you sit up there, you check the chicken. No, calm down, don't worry. Don't worry, three orders in the other I know, but I can't get them together. Just okay. give me a second. Like, shit. I can't even get myself back together because I'm getting irritated. Because I'm thinking on something I know how to do. Keisha, get it back together! Yes, Chef! The message from Christina helped me out a lot to keep my mind cool. I need a thing to win. As frustrated as I got, I remember the words that she told me. You can't lose your confidence. Always cook with confidence. I'm walking with these three now. That's it. Perfect. Thank God. Service, please. I got that salmon. What in the fuck is going on? Salmon is raw, and the chicken is as dry as a fucking camel's arsehole in a fucking desert storm. Look how stringy that is. Her, Chef. Hey, no, 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 not hers. No, stop. That's food that's leaving the kitchen expected to be served. No, 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 no! It feels like I just took one, two, like three uppercuts straight to the gut. Let me communicate something to you all. Get out! Get out! He's kicking me out. And so much for Wendy Williams being a source of inspiration. Uh. VIPs, 
You certainly didn't treat them like VIPs. Pathetic. Absolutely pathetic. Ah, oh, ladies. We've only been through three dinner services. We've been kicked out of the last two. It's a disgrace. Oh, fuck, man. Chicken. Chicken is coming, chef. Coming up, behind. Chicken at the pass. Raw chicken again. Hey. It's fucking redder than your beard, and look at me. But it's still raw. Yes, sir. No, no. I'm done. No. No. Come on, man. We got to bounce back, baby. Jason screwed up two times now. Like, what the fuck are you doing? I just need the fucking chicken. How long? I need to check these. We need to cut them open. You cook. Where do you want me to cut it? Here. You're both sat there discussing it. The plates are empty. That one's done. Coming right now, chef. All right. Right behind. Chicken up. Free chicken. OK, go, please. Who cooked here. this chicken? I did, chef. Come here. Let's go all together now. Come on, You man. hold the chicken. Yes, sir. Hold the chicken. Pass it around. There I thought go. either pan was going to get thrown, glass was going to get shattered. Someone was getting hurt. Show me the ball. Let's fucking plate around us. It happened to be the chicken, so sorry to the chicken. It's rubber, plastic, dry shit. Millie. Yes. Excellent. <laughs> and you're from where, bud? Philly. So, <laughs> Philadelphia. Millie from Philly. Yes, sir. Right. And is that a stick on or is that? Oh, no, 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 it's real. Yeah, that's a lot of hard work. Okay. Does it ever catch fire? Uh, no. No. Because <laughs> it is long. Yes. Huh? Yes. Yes. What's under the dome? Uh, I have a, a seafood mac and cheese with a citrus gremolata. Wow. So it's a posh mac and cheese. Yeah, sure. I put heavy cream, add a little eggs, and butter. It's good. Three. Good job. Thank you. Hoping to put the red team back on top with her rainbow trout is an executive chef from Virginia, Megan. This is stunning. Thank you. Definitely uh, a five for five. Good job. Thank you. With the first perfect score going to Megan, the women are back in the lead. Up next, executive chef Michael versus food truck owner and chef Chrissa. I was in the cookie aisle, and I was looking at cookies. What in the fuck is that? <laughs> that is ginger crusted chicken. I was in the cookie aisle. I was trying to get ideas, and I have ginger cookies. Ginger, ginger cookie ginger crusted cookie. chicken breast. Yep. That's what's in there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad you were inspired in the cookery aisle, not the fucking pet food aisle. Oh. Oh, really? Oh, oh no. Oh, my god, really? Oh. I mean, that is hideous. Sorry. One out of five. I'm not really used to people spitting out my food, so it was very embarrassing. A uh, young man, first name is? Michael Chef. And what do you do for a living? I work for a Jewish kosher, upscale uh, senior living. Anyone ever passed away eating your food? <laughs> Not that I know of. Not that you know of. What's under the dome? Chef, I have an herb roasted chicken breast. Wow. You know, it's solid. It's not spectacular. Yes, um, three out of five. Good job. Thank you, Chef. Thank you. It's OK. I knew it. With Chris's chicken losing the lead for the women, New York line cook Allison's red snapper. Sauce is runny. Three. Comes up short against New Jersey executive chef Adam's rack of lamb. Lamb's cooked perfectly. Thank you, chef. Yeah. I'm going to give that four out of five. Thank well, you very much. Yeah. Good job. Good job. The men now have a two point lead over the women, but Atlanta line cook T is looking to put the red team back on top with her coffee crusted flank steak. It's just suddenly dawned what T stands for. Terrific. Great job. Five out of five. Thank you. The women have posted another perfect score, and now New Jersey sous chef Cameron is hoping to reclaim the lead with his coriander rubbed rack of lamb. Lamb's cooked nicely. Four out of five. Good job. 